you're planning to recycle all that paper. Hi, Kel. What are you writing? The great American novel? Hardly. It's a letter. Well, tell Brenda I said hello. It's not a letter to Brenda. It's from my father. He's up for parole. Yeah, I heard that on the news. I'm supposed to write this glowing letter to convince the parole board of what a fabulous father he is, you know? Needless to say, the words aren't coming easy. I'll just leave you alone, then. No. I need a break. You want to get a soda or something? Sure. So how's it going? Oh, not so hot. Things with Jake and I didn't go so well. Oh. You know, when I told him not to mess with you. You talked to him about me? Yeah. I really got sucked in. I ended up throwing myself at him. Yeah, well, some people have that kind of power. Can I have a couple of mineral waters, please? Well, I guess I'm done with guys for a while. But thanks for trying to look out for me. Oh, hey, come on. We're in the same kindergarten class, remember? Oh, that's right. Miss Carney. As I recall, you were the king of quiet time. So you're having a hard time with this letter? Yeah. I just can't come up with a single flattering thing to say about my own father that I actually believe. Well, when in doubt, lie. May have to. Hey, Andrea. Where are you off to? I have a date. Oh. Hey, listen, what do you want to go running off that guy to Houston for anyway, huh? Don't you approve? I don't need your permission to do this, Brandon. No, it's, it's not that. I just, just kind of wish you were sticking around here for the summer. I miss riding to work with you every morning, helping you out with the kids. That's sweet. Most of all, I'm going to miss you. Brandon. How is that? It's just how I feel. Look, don't insult me like that, okay? Not now. Wait, 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 what are you talking about? The only reason you're the slightest bit interested in me is because I'm seeing someone else and you know it. That's not true. Oh, yeah? Then where have you been the last couple of years, Brandon? You had your chance. You made your choice. I'd appreciate it if you get out of my way because I have a date. So break it. What makes you think you're so damn irresistible? What is it about guys that makes them suddenly want the one girl they can't have? I don't know. I think it's hormonal. Hey, come on. Let's go. Come on. Everybody. One, two, three. Run, 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 run. Let's go. Yeah. Andrea. Andrea, hey. Not now, Brad. No, come on, please. Just listen to me for one minute, OK? I didn't sleep much last night. I was thinking a lot about what I did and what you said. And? And you were right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend you or insult you. Apology accepted. That's it? Mm -hmm. Just like that, apology accepted? You know, you do have every reason in the world to think I'm scum. Pond scum. Pond scum. With lousy timing. <laughs> so, um... Are we still friends? Always friends. Cool. You really like them, don't you? Yeah. I really do. It's good. I'm happy for you. But I have to admit, you did call it. You never know what you got till it's gone. Thanks.